Hello, hello, good evening. <clears throat> hello, Osman. Welcome, welcome back to Hi, class. Fischer. Hello, I am the first I'm winner. <laughs> <laughs> yes, you are the first Ooh. one. I was kind of worried. <laughs> I was like, maybe they forgot to join to today's class. I thought. <laughs> How are you today, right. Osman? Very good, teacher. Very good. Well, oh, nice. Um, yes, but this day was uh, my first day in my job. Oh, after, okay. After Me too. Holidays. Me too. Yes. <laughs> really? Yes. Cool. Yes, yes, yes. Good, good. Okay, hello, welcome Carla. How are you today, Carla? Hi, teacher. Fine. Fine? Yeah. Yes. Okay. Good. It's good to see you. Welcome, Brian. Javier. How are you today, Brian? So how was your vacation? How was it? Tell me, everyone. How was your vacation? In my case, uh, I went to the beach uh, one day last week. Where? Uh, uh, Metalio. I don't. I don't know. I don't know where Metalio beach is. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> this beach is in Sonsonate. Ah. Okay. 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 Yeah. Nice. Yes. Uh, I. I. I spend good time with my family. Oh, um, good. Yes, uh, only that uh, about uh, go out. With, uh, other days, uh, we spend a lot of time meeting with my family. Oh, cousin, uncle. Uh, yes. Oh, good. It sounds like you had a great time with your family. Yes, yes. Uh, meeting with family. With family. Oh, great. Yes. Uh, who else? Thank Very you. Good. Thank you for sharing us, man. Who else wants to share about his or her vacation? Uh -huh. Any volunteer? Oh, welcome, Miriam. Welcome, Laura. And welcome, Jacqueline, as well. Welcome, Hi, welcome. Good evening. Good evening. How are good you, good Miriam? Good evening. How are you, Laura? Oh, nice. Oh, teacher, my, my camera uh, don't, doesn't work. Oh, your camera doesn't work. Okay, that's fine. Yeah. That's fine. As uh, uh, far as you participate, that's I'm totally fine. Welcome, Jancy. How are you today, Jancy? I'm fine. What, what, what is it? You Microsoft, uh, I mean, your microphone it sounds like kind of low. Mm -hmm. okay Can you hear me? just a little bit just a little bit a little bit but yeah mm -hmm. okay. okay so uh welcome everyone so i would like to know about your vacation who wants to continue sharing about about your vacation uh, about his or her vacation mm -hmm. osman was just sharing about what he did what about you what about the rest uh Miriam? Hi, yes, teacher. Miriam? Hello. Hi, teacher. Yeah, for me, uh my my vacation mm -hmm. was so hard because my granddaughter uh was sick. Was sick. Oh, okay. Yeah, and then uh I went with my granddaughter at the hospital oh. because probably she she has a she had a, a dengue. Oh, uh, is she is she yeah. nice? I mean, is she okay now? Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah. Okay. Oh, I'm yeah. sorry to hear but that. My vacation was in the hospital. <laughs> oh no! So definitely <laughs> was not vacation at all. Mm -hmm. Right? <laughs> yeah. Okay. Uh, so, how, uh -huh, yeah. So. <laughs> okay. Thank you, Miriam. Uh, how are you, Fatima? Welcome. I am fine. Thank you, teacher. Oh, how was your vacation, Fatima? Uh, it was nice. It was nice? Because, uh, yes, uh, because it was a birthday of oh. my... Your birthday? Me. 
my, mi sobrina es niece. Oh, niece. my niece. No, uh -huh. my, yeah, yeah. Uh -huh. My niece. Uh -huh. Oh, okay. Yes. Good. Good, good. Okay, so it's good to see you after a long, long week. I was like, maybe they are not going to remember me anymore. I thought. <laughs> I thought maybe they are not going to come to classes, but it's good to see you all. Um, no sé si, si me pueden escuchar bien o se escucha cortado. I, I just want to make sure that. Mm -hmm. Se escucha un poco cortado, teacher. Okay, okay. Okay, uh, I guess it's the same thing with the internet. So as I said before, uh, I'm going to be turning on and turning off my camera, okay? Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay, so how about now? How, how, how can you listen to me? Can you listen to me well? Much better? Yes. Yes? Better. Okay, good, good. Okay, so welcome one more time. I'm going to share my screen with you today. Vamos a ver si se acuerdan la, el, el último tema que vimos antes de vacación. ¿Se acuerdan? ¿Alguien se acuerda? <laughs> Ajá. Anyone? Yes, teacher. Ajá. So, what was the last, uh, the last topic? Uh, about holidays. Oh, about holidays? Yes, definitely. Uh, we were uh, talking about holidays. Mm -hmm. Okay, good. Okay, good. So to, the topic for today is holidays activity. That's the topic for today. Uh, what is the objective for today's class? In this section, you will listen and practice a conversation about wedding customs adverbial clauses of time will be introduced. Uh, but before I move on to that, eh, ¿cómo van con la plataforma? Me gustaría escuchar. ¿Hay algún problema con la plataforma o algo? Eh, usualmente eh, no ando cont contestando durante el día alguna, alguna consulta sobre la plataforma, pero si ustedes tienen cualquier consulta, ustedes me pueden, eh, me pueden preguntar durante la clase y con gusto eh, les vamos a ayudar. Okay, I don't know if you have any question about the platform. Any question about the platform? Yeah, yes, teacher. Yeah. In my case, uh -huh. uh, sorry. Uh, in my case, is the, I, in section five, mm -hmm. uh, I can pass uh exercise oh okay okay uh, se recuerdan que hay una persona acá eh, en el grupo en el grupo de whatsapp ella es quien les puede dar ayuda directamente no sé si la han contactado directamente a, a ella oh no teacher in my oh. case no ah. solo en, en, en el chat que tenemos allí ajá eh, no eh, no recuerdo eh. el nombre alguien sabe cómo se llama esta persona uh -huh. No. No. Ok, no, uh, creo que se llama Nicole, si no me equivoco. No sé si alguien me puede co colaborar ahí, corroborar el nombre de ella. Nicole, Nicole Narro. Ajá, correcto, ella. Ajá, ella. Ella es la persona encargada. Nicole quien puede... Najarro. Ajá, correcto, correcto. Entonces, ella es la persona quien puede darle seguimiento. Ajá. Uh -huh. Okay, so, but if you have any other question, you can ask. And I mean, like, uh, if you have question directly, I can go over and we can check and work on that in today's class. Mm -hmm. If we have time at the end of the class, uh, maybe we can work on that, okay? Okay, okay good. All right, so um, we were talking about Christmas before. Um, Remember last class we were talking about Christmas and I would like to hear from all of you. Uh, I would like you to complete the following um, sentence. Christmas is a day when, how can you complete that? What can you complete? How can you complete that sentence? Christmas is a day when. When I give. Uh, present 
uh, someone I I love. Excelente, oh. excellent, good, good. Anyone else? Thank you, Osman. Okay. Anyone else? Christmas is a day when. When the people is joy, enjoy, enjoy, oh. Oh. and and eat very many food. <laughs> <laughs> yes, Christmas is a day when people enjoy and eat a lot of food, a lot of food. Okay, good. Thank you. Thank you. Anyone else? How, how do you say recalentado? Oh, that's a good question. Uh, how, let me see. I never thought about that question. Um, recalentado. I would be like refried, but I don't think Free so. Free hot? <laughs> I don't know. Let me look at it and then I'll let you know. Okay. Déjeme buscarlo, pero sería como. Mm, I don't. I'm not sure. Rehated? I mean, Rehated? puedo traducirlo literalmente. Lo puedo traducir literalmente, pero. No creo que esa sea la traducción, uh, I mean, la, 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 la palabra correcta. Debería de haber una expresión que se la debo, pero se la voy a investigar and I'm going to tell you, okay? Mm -hmm. But yes, Christmas is a day Because when people... That's, huh? huh? that's my example. Christmas is a day when we usually eat free-headed food. <laughs> <laughs> thank you. Thank you, Laura. That's a good example. <laughs> okay. Uh, anyone else? Mm -hmm. Alguien más? Yes, Jacqueline. Uh, Christmas is a day when we can put the tree of Christmas. Oh, okay, good, 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 good. All right, thank you. Who else? ¿Quién más? ¿Quién más? Yes. Hello. Anyone else? Somebody else? I'm waiting. Mm -hmm. Okay, it seems like uh, maybe uh, you have forgot about that, but that's okay because we're going to continue working on that today. All right. So uh, let's move on. What about my birthday is a day when? Voy a seleccionar a, a alguno de los que no me han participado. Vamos a ver, Carla Albergue. My birthday is a day when... My birthday is a day when... When my... Eh, ¿Cómo se dice eh, reunirse con mi familia? Ah, uh, mm. I meet with my family or my family When and I, I meet, meet with my old family. Oh, okay. <laughs> okay, good. Thank you. Uh, how about you, Luis? Luis Mesquita. My birthday is a day when? My birthday is a day when I receive gift. Oh, good. Excellent. Thank you. Vamos a ver quién más. Oh, what about you, um, me, uh, Carlos Membreño? My birthday is a day when all the people dress customs. <laughs> really? When is your birthday? Yes. When is your birthday? My birthday is in Halloween. <laughs> oh, <laughs> okay, okay. All right, thank you for sharing your sentence. How about you, uh, Miriam Yvonne? My birthday is a day when? Yes, teacher. My birthday is a day when my my family or my friends uh, can give me uh, some gift. Oh, good. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you so much. Okay. So um, we're going to play an activity right now. And... Uh, the name is category games, okay? So you are going to play the game together and you are going to mention words that the category says, okay? So let me play right now that, that activity. Um, let me see, okay? Um, I'm going to share with you that. Okay, give me a second. 
All right, so we are going to practice vocabulary right now. Okay, uh, we're gonna play vocabulary right now. Give me a second, please. So welcome everyone. I can see that more, more of you have joined us to today's class. So welcome, it's good to see you after what? After a long, long vacation. I hope all of you slept well. Did you sleep well? Do you sleep well? Yes, I did. <laughs> oh, oh, good, good. Very good. I'm no, happy. No, I to... didn't. Oh, you didn't? Why? Why? Uh, I I went to the beach and I... <laughs> <laughs> and you, uh, you drunk? You drunk anything? Mm. No. Maybe. <laughs> One Maybe. or two days. Oh, okay, okay, <laughs> okay. So uh, probably you have a hangover right now, probably. <laughs> no, no. Oh, and, okay, uh, okay, uh, okay, that's fine. Uh, last okay. Sunday, yes. <laughs> <laughs> okay, last Sunday, yes. Okay, so that means yesterday, ayer, yes. or, or, or the Sunday before last one. No, yesterday. Ah, okay, okay. Okay, voy a compartir pantalla en este momento about the game that we are going to play today. Okay, let me see. Okay, uh, we're going to play the category games. And it says, names three things for each category. Okay, so if you want to participate, just raise your hand or let me know or say me, and then you answer the different categories, okay? Vamos a ver la primera. Let's go and see the first one. Vamos a ver. Oh, boys' names. Who wants to tell me that? Who wants to share that? Three boys' names. Me, me? teacher. Okay, Jancy. Okay, Jancy. Okay, okay, boys. And Rodrigo. Anthony, Anthony. <laughs> Anton? <laughs> okay, Anthony Anton. and then, okay, thank you. Let's go to the next one, let's see. Okay, vamos a ver. Quickly, who? Oh, things you only see at night. Anyone else, alguien más? Me, Laura. Okay, Laura. We see a uh, dark sky, we can see the stars, and we can see the moon. Oh, okay, the moon, uh-huh. Mm -hmm. Okay, what else? Remember, son tres cosas, son tres cosas que podemos ver en la noche. Tres cosas, three. Yeah, the, the dark moon, sky. The sky. The moon. Uh -huh. The dark sky and the stars. Oh, excellent. Good. The dark sky, the moon, and the stars. Thank you so much. Okay, let's go to the next one. Let's see. Oh, Disney movies. Who? Meet the chef. Who? Miriam. Miriam. Okay, Miriam. Miriam. Okay, okay. Miriam. Disney movies, um, la de Cinderella. Okay. And uh, La Bella y la Bestia. Okay, The Beauty and the Beast. Mm -hmm. The Beauty and the Beast, the mm -hmm. best. Mm -hmm. And um, uh, La Canieves. Oh. And the Seven. Dwarf. <laughs> Dwarf. It's no, it's no, no white. Snow, ah, no white, white, and the seven white, dwarfs. No white, and the seven dwarfs. Dwarf. Okay, good. Thank you. Thank you. Next. Let's do it very quickly. Me, teacher. Me, Osman. Okay, Osman. Jobs. Three jobs. Uh, I don't understand. Loud noises. A job. Three jobs. Uh, mm -hmm. Engineering. Yeah. Engineer. Uh, engineer. Uh -huh. Doctors. 
Ajá. Uh -huh. Oh, okay, good. Okay, let's do, let's go very quickly to the next one. Thank you, Osman. Next one. Let's see. Okay. Feeling words adjective, Carlos. Feeling words. Feeling words. Uh, uh -huh. Happy. Happy. Uh, sad. Uh -huh. And shy. Shy. Good. Very good. Excellent job, Carlos. Next. Vamos. Dos más and I finish. Two more. Oh, superheroes. Mm -hmm. Who? Me. Who, me? Me, Luis. Okay, Luis. Uh -huh. Batman. Batman. Superman. And Iron oh, okay. Man. Good. The last one. Okay, the <laughs> last one. Vamos a ver the last one. Let's see. Oh, this is an interesting one. Fruits people think are vegetables. Who? Fruits people think are vegetables. Okay, give me a second, Carlos. Let me see somebody. If somebody else doesn't um, say anything. Okay, Carlos, you can talk. ¿Alguien más? ¿Alguien que no haya participado? Uh -huh. Vamos a ver. Vaya, entre todos. Puedo entrar, okay. teacher, pero no sé, no sé cómo funciona la, la dinámica. Acabo de entrar, que no me había dejado el sistema. Oh, oh, oh. Eh, que usted debe mencionar tres frutas que las personas piensan que son vegetables. Ah, vegetables. Vegetales. <ríe> Vegetable. <ríe> que son vegetales. Ajá. Ok. Uh, I can... Uh, you can try. guess. Puede adivinar, puede okay. adivinar. Ajá. Okay. Uh, aguacate. Okay. Uh, um, okay. I have maybe. a question. Avocado yeah. is a fruit or is a vegetable? It's a fruit. It's, it's a fruit. A fruit. It's a fruit. Oh, okay. Good. Really? I didn't know that. Yes, wow. but it's a fruit. It's a tree. It's a tree. When it's a tree, it's a huh? fruit. It's a fruit. Wow, thank you for enlightening me. Gracias por a, a, a ayudarme a mejorar. <laughs> I didn't know that. Uh -huh. Okay, avocado. And, Good. And the next have one. seed. Avocado. Um, uh, I don't know. I don't, I don't know the other. Uh, okay, entre todos, ayudémosle aquí a Miguel. Vamos a ver. Uh -huh. Tomato. Tomato. Cucumber. Tomato is a fruit. It's a tomato is a fruit. It's a vegetable. Vegetable, it's a right? Tomato. Okay. It's, a vegetable. It's, it's a fruit it's because it have seeds. Seeds? Okay. 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 Yes. Okay. All right. Okay. What else? It's new for Come me. Much. This is new the for me too. Cucumber. Cucumber. What do you think? Cucumber? Is that a is that a it's a fruit, but people think that it's vegetable? Vegetable. Oh, okay. Okay, good. Okay, because of the time, I cannot continue playing Lemon. more this activity, but uh, is there any other word? Otra, otra para, otra que sea fruta, pero las personas piensan que son uh, veggies. Huh? Lemon. Lemon? Oh, yeah, yes. lemon. Yeah, lemon, uh, people think that is a, it's a fruit, but it's a, well, well, well. so it's a fruit or <laughs> yeah, it's, it's a, a fruit. It's a fruit. It's a fruit. Whoa, yeah. okay. Interesting. I think it's a fruit. Oh, interesting. Okay, interesting. Thank you for letting me know. Okay, good. So thank you for playing and sharing your knowledge with me. Uh, we will continue with our presentation today. All right. Um, solo quisiera decirles algo por si, si acaso se me va el internet, porque al parecer va a caer una buena tormenta, está tronando muy fuerte. Por si se me va el internet, me voy a conectar del teléfono. Y si, si me salgo por X o Y motivo, me, me esperan y me vuelvo a conectar desde los datos del teléfono. ¿Ok? ¿Ok? Ok. Ok, good. Um, I estaba viviendo aquí en Morazán, por cierto. By the way, it's been raining yesterday. I mean, today in the morning was raining the whole, the whole night, basically. En Zacatecoluca, no yet. Oh, ok. Hopefully soon. 
Soon, soon. Ok. Uh, por si se, se les ha olvidado, ¿se acuerdan que esto fue lo último que vimos la semana, uh, la semana previa a la de vacación? ¿Do you remember that? ¿O no lo vimos? Yes, teacher. Yes, teacher. Yes, right? I remember. Okay, good. Yes. Okay, good. So we were talking about relative clauses uh, the week before vacation. And I'm not going to spend too much time because this is basically a review. A review that we are going to do it very quickly. Uh, remember that I told you that when we use relative clauses is because we have what? We have two clauses, two sentences joined by a relative clauses. Le dije que relative clauses une dos oraciones. Remember? Okay, dos oraciones. Okay, so we have sentence number one and let me see. Okay, um, sentence number one and sentence number two. Okay, yes, definitely when we use um, the relative clause when we are using two sentences. For example, Thanksgiving is a day when, when we celebrate the harvest. February 14 is the day when people give cards to the ones they love. Okay, help me out here. Mother's Day is a day when. Tres ejemplos. ¿Quién me lo quiere dar el primero? Mother's Mi Day teacher, is a Miriam. day. Miriam. Okay. Miriam. Mother's yes, Miriam. Day is a day. Yeah, teacher. Mother's Day is a day when the sons, sons give difference, uh, give uh, at their mothers. For example, Good. food, mm -hmm. cloth, shoes, uh, uh, flowers, etc. Wow, good, excellent. Thank you, Miriam. Second, second sentence. Mother's Day is a day when. Jacqueline, thank you, Jacqueline. Mother's Day is day when uh, we can we can share more time with my with our, our mom. mothers. Uh -huh. Good, Me excellent. Too. Thank you, Jacqueline. Next, who wants to be a volunteer? Mother's Me Day too. is a day when. Me? Who is me? Me, teacher, Jancy. Oh, Jancy, okay, good. Go, yes. Jancy. Mother's Day is a day when you can carry mariachi. Oh, mariachi, yes. yes, yes. Okay, thank you. Thank you so much, uh, Jancy, that's a good example. All right, good. So, como les mencioné, eh, ahorita estamos reviewing, estamos reviewing, estamos como repasando, right? So I'm not going to spend too much time in this one. Okay. También hicimos esto, ¿se acuerda? Do you, do you remember that we did this? Yes? Okay, yeah. number one. Who wants to help me, number one? So estoy refrescándole un poco uh, your memory, right? Number one. New Year's Eve, it's a night when... ¿Qué dijimos que era New Year's Eve? New Year's Eve... La noche previa de año, año nuevo. nuevo. Nosotros decimos año nuevo. Ah, la año fiesta nuevo. de año. De fin de año decimos. La fiesta de fin de año o fiesta de año nuevo. ¿Ok? Yes. Yes. What letter is number one? The letter C. The letter C. Yes. Good. Number two. Letter F. Good. Letter F. Excellent. Good. ¿Cómo es? Uh, how do you say that April Fool's Day in Spanish? How do you say that in Spanish? Inocente. Día de los Inocentes. Día de los Inocentes. When is it in El Salvador? In December. But December. December. Okay. Vaya. Tengo, 28. Aquí hay okay, 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 algo que me gustaría mencionarlo. Vaya. Cuando hablamos del Día de los Inocentes, eh, según la Biblia, habla de los niños. You know that, right? That is in December, right? Pero el, el, el April Fool's Day no se refiere a ese día de la celebración, ¿ok? April Fool's Day is different. Al de bromas. Ajá, exactly. Es cuando tú caes en las trampas, like a trick. People gives, uh, tells you like some lies. And you believe in those lies. And you know, hey, happy Fool's Day. Feliz Día de los Inocentes. Pero es porque has caído en una trampa o en una mentira. O en una broma, ¿ok? So just try not to get confused with the... Um, the Innocence Day or the Children's Day when we celebrate that on December, which is a completely different uh, thing. Okay. 
Okay, uh, number three. Summer is a time when? The letter B, students have a break from school. Yes, good. Well, as you know, uh, in the United States, in the United States, people have a student have a break. And that's basically from June, July, and August. Kids come back to school on September. La primera semana de septiembre, kids go to school. Las universidades in the United States, uh, they go back to school on the second or third week of August. Okay? That's why it's summer. Para ellos, summer is vacation over there. And you know, here in El Salvador, it's completely different. When is vacation here in El Salvador? October, November. Yeah, December. October, November, and December, and part of January. Mm -hmm. Y cuando es summer también. Cuando es summer acá? From what time to what time is summer in El Salvador? March or April right now? Yeah, from November to May. May? Yeah, to May or April. Yeah, June. April. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah. Okay, number four. Valentine's Day is a day when? The letter E. Letter? Yes, letter E. Good. Thank you. Okay. Number five, Labor Day. Letter D. 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 Good. D. By the way, when is Labor Day in El Salvador? First of May first. May the first or um or first um May first. Mm -hmm. Oh, do you know what time is gonna be? What what day is it gonna be? Saben qué día será? Yes, Sunday. Sunday. I know, that's what I'm crying like. Ah, no way, no, mm -hmm. no. Uh, the good thing is that Mother's Day, it's, <laughs> when is Mother's Day? When is Mother's Day? On Tuesday. Yes, Tuesday. Tuesday. So if you work on Tuesday, yes, you are going to have a day off. Pero Labor Day, ¿por qué tuvo que caer domingo, right? ¿Por qué? Why? <laughs> yes. Um, okay, good. Number six. Number six. The last one, right? A. A, yes. North America celebrate the harvest. Okay, good. Okay. Vamos a la siguiente. Next. Vamos rápido, okay? Okay. So today we're going to be talking about some customs. Customs about or in other countries about what about how to get married or what happens when people get married in other countries and we're going to be comparing with the celebrations in el salvador okay so as you can see okay look at those people okay do not read do not read the dialogue look at the people where are they from look at the people de donde cree que son ellas look at the people and the picture. One of the United States Oriental. and the other is in China. Okay. One American and the other Chinese. Okay, good. Uh huh. Who else? Another guess? Japan. Japan. Okay. Okay. Do not read the dialogue. Okay. Just go and see the picture only. Only see the picture. Okay. Who else? American. Chinese, Japanese, okay? All right, good, good guess. Let's see. I would like you to go and, and see the dialogue. I want you to read the dialogue and let me know if there is any new word that you don't know, okay? Go to the dialogue and check it out. You have two minutes to do so. Dos minutos para leer el dialogue. And check out if there is any new is the if there is any new word.
Yes, you were right. Uh, comida recalentada, that would be uh, reheated food. <laughs> Thank you, teacher. Uh -huh. That's the best food ever, by the way. Reheated food. <laughs> que tamales, que pollo, que empanadas, everything, right? <laughs> okay. Uh, new words. Oh, shrine. Good. Shrine. Oh, it's a shrine. Let me see. Shrine, shrine, shrine. What is shrine? What is shrine? I don't see it. It's for Emiko. Uh, the one, two, oh, four. here. Dialogue. Good. Shrine. Okay, good. What other word? What other word? Um, Sanctuario? Suspicious. Afterwards. Afterward. Afterward. Okay, good. What is afterward? Afterward. What is afterward? I'm looking for it. The first uh, dialogue of Emiko. Oh, we use afterward. Okay, good. Okay, what are the words? Species. Somebody says species. Okay, what is species? Oh, I see here. Give it species. Okay, another word. Okay, I hope you're getting new vocabulary today. Mm -hmm. Uh, what is the meaning? Guess it. Ah, huh? the guess it. Oh, the get. What is guesses? After oh, the all guesses. the species. Yeah. Oh, okay, good. Let's go with shrine. Okay, can you see these? This, this is a shrine. 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 No. Mm -hmm. Ah. Yeah, you know that, uh, for example, it, it, in Japan, it, it, the religion is different, right? Over there, Christian, santuario teacher. Yeah, santuario, a santuario, a like, place like where this. they go to worship. Um, any like God. a church. Yeah, like, like a, church. a church. Yeah, like, for example, if you're a Christian, uh, you go to a church and you pray over there. But in Japan, um, people over there, they don't, they don't have churches, they have shrines. Okay, shrine. Shrine. Okay, yes, shrine, shrine, shrine. shrine. Okay, shrine. what about afterward? What is afterward? Afterward is a synonym of after. After, a synonym. After. Okay, after. Después. Yes, después. Okay, that's a synonym. And speeches. It's like, for example, um, when you go to a wedding and, and there is a, the best man, el mejor amigo, right? And they say, okay, today I'm going to read a speech. Okay? Speech. Speeches. Okay? That would be in Spanish would be, um, how would it be that in Spanish? Speech. Discurso. Un discurso, yes, un discurso, exactly. So you go and people talk and say, oh, he's my best man, or he, and then you give um, speeches and saying congratulations to the people who got, uh, who got, who is getting married at that time. What about guests? Mm -hmm. If I invited you to come to my wedding, you are the guests. Mm -hmm. Invitado, right? Invitados. Invitado. I am the host. Okay. You are the guest. I am the host. Okay. Can you get that? Do you get that? I'm the okay. host. You are the guest. You come to my party. I hold a party for everyone. Yes. You're reading the host? Huh? Anfitrión. 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 Yes, I'm the host. Hey, host, uh, welcome to my party. Host? Welcome, welcome. I'm the host. You come to my party, you are the guests. Mm -hmm. Anfitrión, invitado. Okay? Oh, okay. Anfitrión. Groom. 
Ok. No. ¿Qué es groom? Vamos a ver. What is groom? Groom, groom. What is groom? Novio. Novio. Yes. Yes. Aquí está. The bride and the groom. Ok. Ah, ok. Novia y novio. Exactly. Pero no es okay. decir que se, no se refiere a girlfriend and boyfriend. Noviazgo. Ajá. No. It's not oh, yeah. boyfriend and girlfriend. No, no, no. It's hey, As at the wedding day, en el día de la boda. Oh, yeah. Uh, oh, ahí viene la novia. Oh, the bride is coming. Yeah. And then, ahí viene el novio. Boo. Nadie le da aplausos <laughs> al novio, right? <laughs> yeah, sadly, yeah. Nobody, nobody looks at us. <laughs> Only to the bride. Por el dress, right? Por el vestido. Okay, good. All right, so... Uh, let me check uh, pronunciation. Let me see the time. Yeah, we're we're good. We are good. Okay, let me see. Let me clear everything. Okay, there we go. Okay, good. Um, let me see. I would like you what to. What about bright? Yes. Huh? What about bright? Bright. It's a uh, la novia. La novia. En el día de la boda es la novia. No es decir que es la girlfriend, ¿verdad? Oh, ahí viene el, the girlfriend. The girlfriend is coming. No. ¿Ok? Girlfriend es como la novia antes de la boda. En la boda it's bride. 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 Y por yes. aquí es groom. 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 Yes. Groom. Mm -hmm. Exactly. Thank you, Miriam. Yes. Bride, novia, and groom. Novio. Excelente. Good. Okay. All right. So I would like you to open your microphones because now we are going to practice this dialogue together. Right? So, quiero que, um, vamos a ver, Emiko van a ser todos los hombres y Jill van a ser las mujeres. Okay? So, yo lo, yo lo digo and then it's going to be your turn. I repeat one more time. Jill are going, uh, is going to be the ladies and Emiko, the boys. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, uh, to the count of one, two, three, go. Uh, your wedding pictures are really beautiful, Emiko. Your wedding pictures are really beautiful. Uh, your wedding pictures are really beautiful, Okay. But no, no, no me dejen abajo, por favor, okay? Jill van a ser las chicas y Emiko van a ser los chicos, okay? Vamos, one more time. Your wedding pictures are really beautiful, Emiko. Your wedding, your wedding, your wedding pictures, pictures are really beautiful, beautiful Emiko. Emiko. Thank you. Those pictures are from right after the ceremony. Thank you. Thank you. Where was the ceremony? Where, 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 was, where was the ceremony? At a shrine, when people get married in Japan, they sometimes have the ceremony at a shrine. At a shrine, when people get married in Japan, they sometimes have the ceremony at a shrine. Where was the ceremony? Where was the ceremony? Okay, give me a second, por favor. Deme un segundo que viene el agua. Espérame un momentito, okay? Un momentito. Okay. Okay, I'm back. Uh, vamos con Jill. That's interesting. Were there a lot of people there? That's interesting. interesting. Were there, there a lot of people there? there? Well, usually only family members and close friends go to the ceremony. But afterward, we had a reception with family and friends. 
well, well so you probably the only, only family, family members and close, close friends, friends to go to her money. But afterward, afterward but I had a we had a reception with, with family and friends. friends. So what are receptions like in Japan? So, so what, so are, what are, are receptions like in Japan? Like in Japan? There is a big dinner, and after the meal, the guests give speeches or sing songs. There is a big There's dinner, a big dinner, and after, and after the, the meal, meal the guests, the guests give, speeches give speeches or, or sing, sing songs. songs. It sounds like fun. It, it sounds, sounds like, like fun. fun. It, like fun. <laughs> it really is. And then, before the guests leave, the bride and groom give them presents. It really it is. It really is. And, and, and then, then before, the, before the, guests the guests leave, leave the, bride the bride and groom, and groom give them, them presents. Present. The guests get presents. They get, they get, they get present, present, presents. presents. Yes, and the guests give money to the bride and groom. Yes, yes. And, and the guests give guest money, give to, the money to, the to the bride and groom. Okay, thank you. Thank you so much. Okay, I just have a short question for everyone. How do you pronounce this word? How do you pronounce that word? Lip. Lip. Live. Ok. ¿Y cómo pronuncian esta, hora, esta otra palabra? Déjenme ver aquí. Aquí la escribo. ¿Cómo pronuncian esta? Live. 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 La primera. It's the same. It's the same. Live. 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 No. Live. Live. The pronunciation is different. The first one is live. live. Y la otra live. es como que haya live. una letra I live. más larga. Live. Exacto. Live. Live. No, 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 no. Don't get confused. Live. Okay. Live. No se me confunda. Live. Okay. Okay. Let me explain first. Esta palabra, you can pronounce it in two different ways. Okay. Por ejemplo, Facebook Live. Okay. Facebook mm -hmm. Live. Pero, live. ajá, que es un nombre. Cuando es nombre, se pronuncia live, cuando es un nombre, pero cuando es un verbo, se pronuncia live, ok, live, I live en Gotera, I live en San Salvador, I live en Sonsonate, pero cuando es un nombre, como por ejemplo, hey, hey, uh, I'm going to be in Facebook live, si ven ahí, en ese contexto es un nombre, ok, perfecto, ahora, aquí, con este otro verbo, ¿qué significa? ¿Qué significa este verbo? Dejar. Dejar, Marcarse. correcto, Dejar. correcto. Vaya, ahí lo que van a hacer es como uh, hacer un sonido más largo. largo. Por ejemplo, look, no sé si sí. pueden ver uh, my mouth. Can you see my mouth? Leave. Oh, como que sí. se están sonriendo. Leave. Sí. ¿Sí? Y la otra es I live, ¿sí? Live, live, live. La otra es live. ¿Sí? Live. I don't know if you can see my face. Can you see my face? <laughs> can you see my face? Yeah. Ok. Va, perfecto. Recuerden, la primera es una I corta. Live. I live in Gotera. Live. La otra es una I larga. I live. ¿Ok? ¿Estamos claros ahí? Yes. Yes, yes. Is it clear? Is it clear? Yes. Ok. Good, good. All right. Vamos, continuemos con la siguiente. Ok. Let's go to the next one. Ok. So, I have a question for you. What happens when people get married in El Salvador? Ok, voy a escribir mi oración. Miren cómo será mi oración. Look. Ok, la voy a escribir acá. 
when people get married in El Salvador, they have a party. Yeah, what about you? What do you think? When people get married in El Salvador, ¿qué, qué pasa? What happens? They have a party, yes. Ajá, ¿qué pasa? Uh -huh. They go to, they have a the honeymoon. Honeymoon. <laughs> oh, yes. okay, good. Lo más interesante, huh? eso piensan, ¿verdad? Uh -huh. <laughs> they have a honeymoon. Good. ¿Qué más? ¿Qué más pasa? When people get married in okay. El Salvador. Uh -huh. When people get married in, in El Salvador, uh, they uh, receive some gift. Okay. Some present. Okay, good. ¿Qué más? ¿Qué más? ¿Qué más? ¿Qué más? When people party. get Oh, okay. Thank you. ¿Qué más? ¿Qué más? Mm -hmm. When people get married in El Salvador, they have a honeymoon, they receive some gifts. What else? Salvador, they have well for civil and well for religion wedding. Oh, oh, okay. Can you repeat that one more time, please? Can you repeat that? I don't know if correct, but when the people get married in El Salvador, they have two dates, one for civil wedding and one for religion wedding. Oh, okay, good. It, it tiene como dos fechas. Yes, Una para they had two weddings, the, okay? The religion uh -huh. one and the civil one, okay? Good. ¿Qué más? ¿Qué más? Deme ideas, por favor. When people get married in El Salvador. Mm -hmm. They dance. Oh, they dance. A lot. Ok. Ok, vaya. Como ya les hice el primer ejemplo, ahora quiero que me hagan el ejemplo de la church. Ok. Aquí lo voy a colocar. Miren, aquí. When people go to church. ¿Qué pasa? What happened? Y ahora quiero que me vean al chat, por favor, y me escriban. ¿Qué pasa cuando las personas van a la iglesia? Puede ser, se visten así, cantan. ¿Qué es lo que ellos hacen? Uh -huh. Press formal. Ah, ok. Bueno, quiero que me escriban la oración, por favor. Uh -huh. When people go to church, what happens? Vamos al chat. Vamos al chat, por favor. When people go to church, coma. Vamos a ver en el chat. Vamos a ver. When people go to church, coma. Don't forget the coma, Miriam. When people go to church, they worship God and pray. Ok, good. Vamos a ver otro ejemplo. Jacqueline, when people go to church. Mmm, Jacqueline, ahí falta un sujeto. Jacqueline. When people go to church, are happy. ¿Quiénes? ¿Quiénes son happy? Ok. Miguel Antonio, when people go to church, sing hymns. Pero ¿quién es? ¿Quién es Miguel? Ok. Puede ser acá, puede ser they. No se los olvide, necesitamos un sujeto. Eh, creo que se los dije la vez pasada. En español, nosotros omitimos los sujetos. Pero en inglés, es necesario que siempre ocupemos los sujetos. The subject. Va a ser Fátima. Uh, ok, let me see Miriam. No, 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 wait, wait, wait. Uh, let, me, let me see the example. Oh, Carla. When people, when people go to church, talk with God. Who? ¿Quién es Carla? ¿Quién es? When people go to church, mm -hmm. coma. We talk. We they, talk. Ajá. It could be we, we or it could be they. They oh, talk they. with God. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yes. A uh, diferencia fuera, Carla, si usted dijera... When I go to church, I uh -huh. talk to God. Mm -hmm. okay, okay, good. Okay. Vamos a ver, vamos a ver, Virginia. When people go to church, they go with all the family. Good. Vamos a ver, Jacqueline. When people go to church, they are happy. Good. Vamos a ver, Daniel. When people go to church, they ask for forgiveness. Good. Jancy, when people go to church, they are attentive to the preaching. Yes. 
Let me see, Osman. When people go to church, they pay attention. Good. Miguel, when people go to church, they sing hymns. Okay, hymns. Okay, good. Let me see, Carlos. When people go to church, they seek salvation. Good. Excelente. Ahora vamos con when people go to the movies. When people go to the movies. Uh -huh. When people go to the movies. ¿Qué pasa? Uh -huh. When people go to the movies. Oh, vamos a ver, Miguel. When people go to church, they pay the tithe. Okay, good. Good. Uh -huh. Or the offering. It depends. Okay, because, uh, for example, um, okay, that's a un buen um, vocabulario el que, el que Miguel está compartiendo con nosotros. Tithe. ¿Saben qué es tithe? Tithe. No. ¿Alguien sabe qué es tithe? Uh -uh. Tithe, uh, if you are like a, an, ev a, an evangelic, if you are Christian evangelic, it's diezmo. Okay? If you are Catholic, that would be offering. La limosna o la ofrenda. Offering. Mm -hmm. Okay? Vamos a ver. Mm, vamos a ver. When people go to the movies, they buy hot dogs and candies. <laughs> Good. When people go to the movies, Miriam. ¿Quién es Miriam? ¿Quién es? Miriam, ¿está ahí? Miriam, Miriam. Yes, teacher, I'm sorry. <laughs> ah, okay, okay. ¿Qué pasa? ¿Quién es? When people go to the movies, buy popcorn and soda. ¿Pero quién es? ¿Saben que cuando colocamos una, una coma significa que cerramos una oración y comenzamos otra? Y ustedes saben que toda oración necesita un sujeto. ¿Ok? Let me see, Fátima. When people go to the movies, they buy popcorn. When people go to the movies, they eat popcorn. When people go to the movies, they see a movie. When people go to the movies, they shouldn't bring their babies. <laughs> okay, Daniel. Al menos que la película sea para niños. Right, Daniel? Okay. Vamos a ver, Carlos. When people go to the movies, they buy a lot of popcorn. Excelente. Good. Okay. Excelente, excelente. Veo que han tomado bien este tema. Why? ¿Por qué? Let me close this one. And I had two more minutes. Un minuto más y nos vamos. Okay. Tomorrow we are going to continue with this one. Okay. Tomorrow we're going to continue with this one. And definitely we're going to be talking about adverbial clauses. Ya lo estuvimos practicando ahorita. So tomorrow is not going to be a big deal. It's not going to be a big problem with this one. It says... When people get married in Japan, coma, they sometimes have the ceremony at the, at the what? At a shrine. After the food is served, the guests give a species of sing song. Before the guests leave, the bride and groom give them presents. See? ¿Qué son los adverbial clauses? Son estas oraciones que vemos acá. Estas oraciones. ¿Ok? Y solo esta cosita que se ve acá, estas palabritas son los adverbial clauses that start with the adverbial sentence. ¿Ok? But I feel like uh, you only need to know that every time we start with when, after and before, necesitamos qué? ¿Qué necesitamos? Coma. A coma. Yes. ¿Cómo? ¿Por qué? Porque vamos a comenzar con un sujeto. They. Para el clause, main clause. Exactly. Exactly. ¿Sí? Porque siempre que comenzamos un adverbial clause con when, after, and before, we need commas because that ah. means that we are going to start with a subject. ¿Se acuerdan el ejemplo lo que yo les decía? El sujeto no se les olvide. El sujeto no se les olvide. Y eso es porque esta es una adverbial clause y vamos a comenzar con un subject. But no worries, tomorrow we're going to continue talking more about this topic and no worries about it. Okay, and I'm sorry, I don't have enough time. It's uh, 9 p.m. Wow, I didn't feel the time. So I hope tomorrow I'm going to see you one more time in here. Okay. Thank you. Okay, thank you. Thank I will you see time. you tomorrow, thank okay? You. Okay, bye-bye. See you bye, tomorrow. Bye. Bye. See you tomorrow. Bye.